Just one thing on Shout. What? How did the the beginning of, of Shout start? Are you kidding me? Did they asked me to ask. Well, you? that's exactly how it started. <laughs> Shop, throw legs up and show hard up and throw head back and come on now. Don't forget to say you will. Say, oh, come on, you're supposed to do the BBs. Yours is say <laughs> you will. And then I go, throw your head back, baby. Yeah, come on. Come they on. don't want me, they just want you. Throw That's... your head back. Woo! Now you've started me. I can't start. <laughs> <laughs> so, who came up with the idea of the whole take that? Uh, I think it was the boys and their manager, Nigel. But I get a call from my record company. Tony says, Peter Robinson says, you know, take that one and do a re record with you. I said, take that? You mean those boys, those little boys? <laughs> that little boy band? Such a supercilious, you know, <laughs> full of herself, old fart I was. But that was great because it was such it a was gear great. change, wasn't it? It was great. They, it, was, it was an amazing, it was another blessing in my life. The Bee Gees have got to be the greatest, some of the greatest songwriters when I was married to Morris, right. to be in their presence when they were writing. I was getting a master class. Yeah. <laughs> and I only know that at this point. What, would they write in the studio? They would write at home, they'd write in the studio. We always end, you know, I always had to go to Barry's. He was the eldest brother and, <laughs> and we all, everybody got along. I got along very well, obviously, with his wife, Linda, fellow Scott. Yeah. Barry literally would have a cup of tea, his special cigarette and his guitar, and then it would start. Wow. Who should we write this one for? Oh, let's do it for the Beach Boys. And they'd start writing <laughs> songs that could possibly be recorded by the Beach Boys, yeah. which would become a BG song. Sure. But you're now busier than ever, right? Oh my goodness. The shows, the tours are just going so well, selling out, you know, really them pulling down the house. And it's just like, I, I, I probably love it more than I ever did mm -hmm. and appreciate it. Yeah. More than I, and the fact that I can still cut it is, I'm so grateful. You know, I can still hit the notes. I still can sing and, I'm still agile, so I feel I'm very, very, very fortunate.